So you've been asked to go to a child protection conference. You'll probably have a lot of questions. What is it? Why is it happening? Who'll be there? What will happen in the conference? What will happen after the conference? Let's look at the answers one by one. A child protection conference is a meeting. It's arranged when people are worried about you and your family. You'll know there's going to be a meeting because your social worker will talk to you about it and you and your parents will get a letter inviting you to go. The meeting will take place in a council building, either in Crewe or in Macclesfield, depending on where you live. The person in charge of the meeting is called an independent reviewing officer. Some people might call them the IRO or chair. Some of the people there will already know you, like your social worker and a teacher, while others, like the school nurse and a police officer, might be there to provide information. Don't worry, the police aren't there because anyone's in trouble. They won't even be in uniform. And your teacher won't treat you differently or talk about what's said at the conference. They won't tell anyone unless they really need to know. And they won't ask you questions in front of your friends or talk about it with other students. When you arrive for the meeting, the receptionist will tell the IRO that you and your parents have arrived and you'll be shown into the family room. There, the IRO will talk to you about the meeting and answer any questions you might have. Then you'll go into the conference room and the IRO will show you where to sit. You'll be with your parents and everyone else. Everybody will introduce themselves and you just need to say your name. The social worker will explain why people are worried about you and your family. The IRO makes sure everyone has a chance to speak, including you and your parents. The meeting will talk about things that are going well for you, as well as what people are worried about. If it gets too much, you can leave the room for a few minutes and come back when you're ready. The next part of the meeting is to decide if a child protection plan is needed. This describes what we need to do to keep you safe at home and might include things like helping your parents make sure you get to school on time every day or making sure you're not hungry. It might mean working with your parents to protect you from scary adult behaviour like shouting and fighting or drinking too much. A child protection conference has just one aim to make things better or safer for you. That's why it's important that everyone knows what you think, how you feel and what matters to you. It means you're being listened to because everyone wants to hear what you have to say. It means people are trying to help and that you and what you say can help make your life and your family's life better. If you really don't want to go, you don't have to. There are other ways to have your say like having someone else tell the meeting what you think, or meeting the IRO separately, or writing a letter, or recording what you want to say. This is your chance to have your say, so don't miss it. It's really important that you're heard. This is how other families felt after their conferences. I can have friends around to stay at my house now. It's clean all the time and my room is decorated. I'm happier now. Things are a lot better for us now. I had my say about what was going to happen. I told them what I wanted and what was important to me. I felt listened to.